12,743 miles separate Nairobi from Clay County, where Kelsey Couch and Tammy Brock go to school at Redbird. The two seniors are taking a three-week trip to Kenya, landing in Nairobi in a few short weeks on a mission to share Christ's message. I visited the school today to find out more about their plans once they get to Africa and how they're going to foot the $5,000 bill. In a few short days, these two will graduate from Redbird. And on Wednesday afternoon, the two ladies discussed what their future holds. I was just driving home and I, I kind of had this kind of feeling like, oh, I should go. And then all, all these fears started coming in. My mind like, well, what if something happens? No, Couch is not talking about college in the fall, although her and Tammy Brock will both attend University of the Cumberlands. She's talking about the three-week mission trip they're taking to Kenya. I want to pray with people. I want to see God in a new way and experience Him in a new way and really just see other people transformed by Him. A teacher who's made the trip before helped guide them along the way. It is scary, it is different, you're definitely out of your comfort zone, but um, I could just sense in them their heart and their desire. When the decision was made, it was time for the fundraising. They sold t-shirts, have a song on iTunes, and just flat out asked for donations. Almost all of the money has came from Redbird. And that's saying something because Redbird's a small private Christian school where the income isn't always great, but they've rallied and been so supportive and generous. Their Redbird family poured into the gym for a send-off pep rally. Without the love and discipleship and just really just encouraging us and even when we get down about the trip or the money or the finances, they're always like, it's going to be okay. The teens will leave Texas for Kenya on June 22nd. Two weeks, the two teens have also created an online ministry. You can find a link to their Facebook page on our website, wymt.com.